I'm my own backup. If, um, if people chat all caps, uh, if, as long as it isn't like a troll question, it's fine. But usually, like, they, usually people type that in that way if they want to get your attention. But, like, if I don't answer the question and you keep on saying it, it's most I get it because I don't want to answer the question. Or, like, it's a question that isn't worth being answered because it should be obvious. My favorite class in Ragnarok is probably Let's the priest. Get to the fun part. I like being priest. They'll never know what. Thirty goes. seconds until minions spawn. The W does true. Oh, let's do true damage. It does percentage physical damage. If you hit a wall, which is hit it OP hard. against creeps, because creeps have super high health. Minions have spawned. Buildover's finest. A summoner has reconnected. Okay, game time. Freak! Or don't. I don't care. Sorry. Save the day. I always do this because like Vi can just like do the like she doesn't need smite to even do red buff or like smite in general in the jungle. But she's so fast at it that like you might as well like you always be able to three. Wukong probably doesn't have a word. So I'm gonna gank him. I'm doing this my way. Uh, although his lane. What the fuck? Go over the gate? Yeah, good trade. Okay, that was really, uh. Wukong was level 1. And then they chose the fight when I was level 3 and Chase was level 2. Which is really interesting. I don't even know what that was. That was really bad on their part. Because Wukong should at least got level 2 before fighting. I let my but is your armor at level 1? It's like so garbage. That's like, you just, just die and it changes. That's why people always die top lane. And like, why? It's like sometimes top laners take like raids or golems or like XP from wolves. And then like when as soon as they hit level 2, they just go all, all on you. And then like you just die. Because your armor value is low. <laughs> Bottom lane is really annoying to king, so I'll, I'll probably go to camp top. Although it I'm is a Wukong, which is annoying. Like all their lanes are annoying. Zed with his W, Wukong with a decoy, Terek with a stun, Ezra with a flash. So it's sort of a really annoying king for this lane. Luckily, someone is using armor runes, I think, so I shouldn't die if that. Guys, a Vajuvi five, so he probably does have a ward because if you notice, he moved. He started moving over here. 
plan. And I came here by a plan. Rage, rather. Don't do that, it's bad. I was gonna buy another longsword just because, like, I don't want to like to gank something and then have them live with like one health. And like, the fact that I didn't buy a longsword is the reason they got away. And yeah, if I is Q, like. Charging it up, like, it's, like, the max damage is when the bar fills up, like, even if you, like, hold it for the whole entire duration, for, like, the, you know, like, five seconds or whatever, it won't do more damage. Like, pr so pretty much just charge it until it gets to the, the full bar. You won't, because you won't do more damage even if you charge it more. Oh yeah, I can't like gank anything right now. Cause Zed probably has both sides of the river warded, so even if I go bottom lane from like a long top. route, I'm gonna find me. I'm gonna probably end up dying. That's why I ban Tarek a lot of the times, cause Tarek's such a good he's such a good and easy support that he's actually really strong just because he's so easy. And that was a pillar harass right there. Really good. Only pillars do damage. Sometimes Honestly, I like smart casting my Q. It just feels more. It just feels a lot better, to be honest, and compared to uh, not smart casting. Like, not smart casting is so weird to me. It's just like, what is this? If you hit a wall, hit it hard. <coughs> Ow, I sneezed. I think I'm getting really sick. Honestly. I'm just gonna pop around Brutalizer, go to red buff, and then probably do Raids or Golems, and then gank. And I'll do so much damage. I'm doing this my way. Thank you, Laser Spear, for saying that. Needs a beat down. Uh, I don't like giving my blue buff, but if if it does really good, I'll give her it. If he went this way, he would have died 100%. So I can't like gank anything. Can't pass by any wolves. Here I come to save the day. Or wreck it. I can kill this guy. Oh, if I um actually no no I think if I hit him the tower would have killed me and like, I don't know. I got him to flash which is fine honestly. And Trundle's near. There's no reason he would try to do this. Wait wait when he ults me like oh, oh wait dude I thought he's gonna ult me. If he ulted me I was just gonna flash and he would die. That's bad. I need a flash there. I thought he would ult me. Let my hands do the talk. I'm not sure if he even has ultimate. But whatever. I'm just gonna farm until I get my ultimate back. Cause again, there's lanes are really hard to gain. Get 
Like, I'm very hesitant with like, because like Zed, Zed can kill you so easily. Like, if you make a mistake, assassins capitalize on mistakes so easily. Like, because if I if I if I if I hit my Q on him, he he could have just like you know ulted me and then like I would probably kill him, but I would probably die too. Just because how his passive works. I mean, what am I doing? Four bottom, so I'm gonna push Nivia. They probably will do dragon off that. But we will get mid turret probably if they do dragon. Like mid turret for dragon is a really good trade, honestly. It's fine. Never and Dragon's probably dead by now, so I'm just gonna go to Wolves and counter it a bit. Let's get cracking. And their blues up. Although I smited, but I'm by, so I'll kill it in time. Like just like that. Like her W is like this is only level one W too. So the fact I kill it that fast is really broken. Like, since I took the blue, that doesn't mean that I can give Anivia our yeah. blue now, because I don't really I care. Because, you know, I have a blue. An ally has been slain. Sometimes, you gotta make a door. Ah, uh, they see Anivia. I can't kill Trundle. If you hit a wall, hit it hard. Ah, uh, he sees me. Look, he's just gonna pull me. Yeah. Honestly, I'm just gonna go uh, get my rates. Honestly, no, my golems in rates. There's two middle, and if you can hold that, especially if you have this blue. I just want to get, like, for, when I go back and buy this item, like, it's such a good item on Vi, just because, uh, the cooldown, like, the reason I, I take blue buff on a lot of my junglers is just because they excel so much with cooldown reduction. Because, if your makes you able to use your E more because it gets charges faster, you're more mobile, and you can gank more. So, like, the, com the combination of Brutalizer plus, plus like, the Spirit of the Elder Lizard makes you just pretty much able to gank a lot more and just do more damage in general. Like cooldown reduction equals damage, especially on AD casters. Not so much on range carries. But on AD casters, yes. They're gonna die for this honestly, so I'm gonna go in. They're moving really fast. His ghost. The trundle. I should be able to clean this up. Especially with Anivia. Yeah, yeah, they're going a bit crazy. I don't need a. Yeah, I don't even need to use my ultimate in this battle. Like, like I can, I can ult him, but there's no point into like, cause they're dead anyway. So I get to save my ultimate, which is really nice. I want to get this tower, so I'm just going to wait a bit. Here 
I, I, what is he doing? Okay. I was a bit scared at first, but I think he might have been AFK. Oh, I have no mana. But I'm just gonna run now. Oh my goodness. No mana to OP, man. So they're pretty much, they're all, whoops, uh, they're all AD, so against this, probably just gonna get Ninja Tabby to a giant spell, and I'll be fine. Plan? I don't need a plan. And it is 2-0-2 with uh, the second most CS in the game. If it's up. Sometimes you gotta make a door. And it's killing Zed. Oh, Zed's dead, maybe. Ooh. Hey, that's Let's kind of pressure middle. Trundles, go yeah, 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 pressuring middle is the best idea right now. Pressure, get this tower and go dragon. Well, actually, I might just pressure it a bit more. Just to get some damage on the turret. Yeah, I like auto attack, like, you know, just chunk it a bit. Yeah, I, just, I got a quarter. That's good. Bottom? Oh, actually, it should, maybe it should have been bottom. I thought they had that. So I'll go there really fast. I'm level 13. Get tons of damage. Free kills. Please give me all the kills. Please. Like right now, I don't need blue anymore. Like, I I, I actually can have this. I don't really care. Like, you can have it. I don't need it. Take that. Oh. <laughs> what? Okay, so my lizard elder buff plus my my red buff plus my item did killed it. So, whoops. But whatever, it's fine. <laughs> I think maybe that's just destiny, like, like XJ9, you're destined to have blue buff. Don't give it to Nivea. I guess I'll go bottom. If I can ult Zed, he's dead, but... Yeah, I should get there in time. Who needs 
Okay, there we go. And then... He's just, oh, he wants to die. Okay. He didn't try to run. I think, I think they're arguing right now. I like moving speed if you haven't tell, like, gonna tell, like, is it, like, home guard gives you, like, a really fast, like, cost efficient, as, oh, that cost efficient, but it's just really efficient at making you, like, like, go back into the battle fast, but, like, these boots give you plus 15 moving speed, so, it'll pretty much help you in a fight more than home guard, because home guard doesn't do anything, besides make you, like, just get back into action faster. E my power. Kill them. I'm gonna die. That's the piece of everyone. Goodbye. No. My passive came up a, like a second later. If, if my passive came up, I would have lived. But it, it honestly doesn't matter because this game's already won. Like they have nothing. Zed has no items. Trundle has a war. Trundle's actually doing the best on their team, besides Caitlyn. The passive. Well, I mean, okay, so pretty much the passive is, like, getting health, like, Warmog, like, Warmog is pretty much the best item in the game right now. So, like, the, it's really good on her just because of the fact that her passive is 10% of her health. And as you, as you level up, um, the cooldown, the... Like, the more you can use it, as in, the more it's up, like, at level 1, it's a 16 second, uh, cooldown of your passive, but, like, it, the lowest you can go is 8 seconds. I'm gonna wait for this. So, pretty much, when you hit, you need to hit something with your ability, not use an ability, you'll get a shield. So, it just makes her, like, really tanky. Like, she can build a war mogs and a bunch of damage items, and she'll be tanky. That's because how much health she has. And plus, it can't be reduced. It's not like she's healing. And we, we can just fight this. So easy. We should just go in. Just, just get to Ezreal, honestly. Bolton. Come here, Ezreal. Wait, Ezreal is one of those fight. So, that means we get to rape everyone. Fight us. I can't ult anyone. I'm gonna ult this guy. Good. Whatever. I wanted that Ezreal. But he's running too fast. But he, he's dead anyway. Many advantages of Flash. What are we doing? I'll tank the turret, I guess. I am probably gonna die. I'm gonna focus on Nexus in the game. Hey, everyone.